All right, Adam, thank you. And guys, it is Monday, so that means we get to check in with local CPA, Jeremy Bork. He joins us virtually. Jeremy, thank you so much for being here with us today. Happy to be here. So today we kind of have a mid-year checkup for, for ourselves, for, for taxes. What advice do you have for our friends at home? Yeah, believe it or not, we are about halfway through the year already. So like June just started, but we're, we're in the last week of it. I can't believe that. It feels like we just did all of our taxes. So what we're at halfway through the year, what should we be doing? What should we be kind of taking note of? So definitely want to make sure you're, you're checking in on your withholdings. Um, so on your most recent paycheck or your pay stub, you can look at how much is being withheld for federal taxes versus Louisiana taxes um, on your in earnings. So like if you, the IRS has a really good tool now. Um, it's on irs.gov. Okay. If you click pay, the top banner, and then tax withholding estimator, um, it guides you through basically a tax return. You know, how do you file? What's your income? You have a spouse. What's their income? Do you have any dependents? Kind of gives you an idea of what your tax return will look like based off of your information to date. So if I was going through this, I would basically take my numbers on my most recent uh, pay stub year okay. to date and just double them because we're halfway through the year. So assuming that the same amount of activity that happened in the first six months will happen in the sec uh, second six months. Okay. And you can see what your tax return would look like based off of what your most recent pay stub is if you're an employee. And we have about a minute left. What about for, for business owners out there? What should they be doing? For business owners, um, a little bit more in depth, right? It's, it's always a moving target. Some businesses have you know a great first half of the year or second half of the year, just in between that. But a good way to look at your business would be comparing your, your revenue or sales year to date compared to last year year to date. So you can get an idea of is that trend going up? And if so, um, if you don't have someone doing you know, some active tax planning for you, you might want to reach out to schedule a meeting. Also, okay. if that those taxes are, or your income's down, your taxes might be down, so you might want to reduce those quarterly payments if you're making them. Okay. This is all great advice, especially it's great to check in on our taxes mid-year. I'm glad that this was our topic for today. If people at home have any questions for you, how can they contact you? They can give us a call, 337-362-5005, or email me at jeremy at jborkcpa.com. Jeremy, as always, thank you so much for hanging out with us. If you at home, you want to learn Happy more, out. head to our website, kdn.com. Everything you'll need will be right there. But guys, up next, we are checking in with Lures. We're